The list of promising areas in organic chemistry is very long um, and I think it relates to the fact that so much of what we see in medicine and in materials and in energy ultimately involves making and breaking bonds in organic molecules. Um, so, uh, you know, the day will certainly come when we're much better at drug design. That will come from advances in our understanding of non-covalent interactions and complex uh, media that will come from improvements in our facility for doing synthesis. It'll come from improvements in our understanding of the complex networks of interactions um, that are perturbed when organic substances are introduced into the, into the medium of biology. Um, so uh, this is certainly an area where the contributions of organic chemistry will continue to be, um, you know, I, I don't see any end to it, honestly. I, don't, I can't imagine there will be any end to it. You know, certainly the day will come where uh, we, you know, we collect the leaves that fall off the trees in the fall and we will learn how to chemically um, deoxygenate all the hydroxyl groups on the, on, 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 the, um, on, the, on the carbohydrate polymers and we'll learn how to depolymerize and fabricate and, um, and uh, you know, the, the, the people are studying these things all over the world now. Um, such that the leaves that fall off the trees will be the sources of all the plastics and all the, f you know, many of the fuels that we might use. And, um, you know, again, this is fundamental organic chemistry uh, of bond making and breaking. Um, you know, so I, I think that, um, you know, my list is not really um, any more sophisticated than anybody else's list. And, and honestly, I think probably some of the most interesting things will come from people uh, wondering out loud about um, things that, that are not on my mind. And many of those things will come from people half my age. And, and part of my job is to make sure that I give them enough of a background about what organic chemistry is at a fundamental level so that they can think in a hypothesis-driven manner about uh, problems that are that are that are just way off my uh, my radar screen, but central to what those same individuals are worrying about.